In this Excel video, I'm going to show you how to sort data based on color. Let's get started. So here I have a spreadsheet that's an inventory of some toys in a store. And as you can see, the names of the toys have some color coding to them. If they are completely out of stock, they show up in red, low stock shows up in yellow, and a good amount of stock shows up in green. And this is working well. But what if I want to organize this with all of the in-stock products at the top, low stock in the middle, and out of stock at the bottom? How could I do this? I would start by clicking anywhere in the column that has the color coding. So how about here? Next, I'll go to the Data tab. Here on the Data ribbon, you'll see the Sort and Filter group, and I'm just going to click on Sort. And I get this nice dialog box that opens up. Here, I can choose to sort by which column. How about the name column? That's where my color coding is. Do I want to sort on the cell values, the information, the text, or numbers inside each cell? In this case, no. Usually that's the one that you want, but in this case, no. I'm gonna click to choose cell color. Next, I get to choose which color will be on top. And notice that Excel can tell which colors are in this column. It's only showing me the three colors that I have in that column somewhere. So I'm gonna choose green. That will be the color that's on top. Now, if I click okay, it will do that sort for me. But before I do, I want to add a second level. Now, in your case, with your own spreadsheet, maybe that won't be what you want to do. But in my case, I have three colors. I'd like them all to be sorted. Again, I'll choose name and cell color. This time I'll pick yellow and I'm gonna keep it saying on top. Now, why would I keep that with on top? I don't really want yellow to be on top. I want it to be second. But notice that there is an order being established here by Excel. First, it's going to sort by green, then by yellow. So this will work. Now, in many cases, you won't need to do the third one, but let's do it anyway. I'll click add level, again, name, again, cell color, this time red, and I'll choose on bottom. Let's click OK and see what happens. When I click OK, my spreadsheet, all of my data is resorted exactly how I would want based on color. I get the in stock products at the top, then the low stock products and the out of stock products. Now, I want you to know that it is also possible to sort not by the cell color, but by the font color. So that is an option as well. So if you change the text color by going to the Home tab and selecting a different font color, you could then sort your data based on the font or text colors. So really, this is one of the lesser known ways by which Excel users can sort their data. I hope you'll give it a try and see ways that it can be effective and useful for you. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this tutorial to be helpful. If you did, please like, follow, and subscribe. And when you do, click the bell and you'll be notified when I post another video. If you'd like to support my channel, consider clicking the thanks button below the video. And you could support me through my Patreon account and by buying channel merch. And you'll see information about those options in the description below the video. Quickly, I want to give a thank you to my $5 Patreon supporters. Thank you so much for all you do to support the channel. I really appreciate it.